lest anybody believe that these Kardashians ever tell the truth about anything. I'm going to give you a scoop right now. Okay. Bottom line is get ready guys, because the scoop, the news is unbelievable. In the meantime, subscribe and like the video. What? Who made that? <laughs> Who made that? Let me see. Let me see. Click on it. Oh, hold on. Chloe, you look at this. What? Let me see. I can put a pillow in the chair. Chloe, come here. I feel like you're the only one that would understand. Okay, I'm coming. I'm not sure what this means. This is a character on Roblox, and it says. What? How, how, I know, that's why I said. That's not my character, that's a game. Oh, it's a game? Yeah. Oh, well then we're suing them. If it's a game with my name and picture. There was a picture of my cry face, and then I looked at it, and it said something super inappropriate, like Kim's new sex tape. No, it was an inappropriate thing that popped up on his Roblox about me. That says they're leaking something that... Some, someone said this is supposed to be unreleased footage from my old sex tape the last thing that i want as a mom is for my past to be brought up 20 years later especially when it's this big party and my whole family's here this is some real embarrassing shit and i need to deal with it and i will deal with it i just cannot believe this is happening right now you should have thought about that 20 years ago it's okay. It's okay. It's not okay though. It's not, you know, on Roblox. You know, Sam was on Roblox yesterday. And a f***ing thing popped up. And he started laughing. I was like, Mommy, look. And it was a picture of my cry face. And it was a game that someone made of Roblox. And it said Kim's new sex tape. When you clicked on it, thank God he can't read yet and it's like over my dead body is this shit gonna happen to me again i just want it gone i don't have any pity for them i don't have any pity for her she should have thought about it 20 years ago she should have th thought about uh, that one day maybe she could have kids or children and she has like m more than three children so what was she thinking but the thing is this is all made up guys this is all made up this is a montage this is this is cinema this is something they have orchestrated for their new show this is not real listen i uh, was the first person to meet with ray j ray j okay. and i met at the cheesecake factory in woodland hills and uh I had no idea who Ray J was back then. My friend over at ABN Magazine called me up and he said, hey, yo, check this out. Uh, I have Ray J. And I said, who? <laughs> he goes, well, he's Brandy Norwood's brother from Moesha. He's Snoop Dogg's cousin. But more importantly, he's Kim Kardashian's ex-boyfriend. And she's mm -hmm. threatening to release this thing for free. Mm -hmm. She wanted to release it for free because she saw what her friend Paris had done. Mm -hmm. And that was the tape that I got involved with. And uh, I urged Ray J to beg her to not release it for free because there was so much money to be made on this thing that she had no idea. So that was my initial meeting with Ray J. But let's get back to what you were talking about. So lest anybody believe that these Kardashians ever tell the truth about anything, I'm going to give you a scoop right now. Okay. Bottom line is they are charlatans. They are liars. They are hustlers. They are hucksters. They are shooting their television show right now. This is a story arc for the TV show. I know for a fact that they made this up out of thin air, okay? The destroyed footage has been destroyed, never to be found again. She knows this. They used her kid, okay, as bait for this arc, the story arc, to make it look like there are more scenes that were deleted. She knows what scenes were deleted out of this thing, trust me, and so do I. And amongst those scenes, there's scenes that I could tell you right now, if they were left in the actual tape, mm -hmm. that family would not be as big as they are today. This is disgusting what they're doing. Using your kids for money, for power. 
That's what I said. Never believe what you see on social media. Never believe what you see on television. And never believe what, what you see and hear about the Kardashians.